Following the latest cyber attack on Sony Pictures, the FBI has warned American businesses to beware of malicious codes. As for the hacking on Sony Pictures, North Korea is speculated to be the culprit as the studio's soon-to-be-released film, The Interview, talks about assassinating regime leader Kim Jong-un. Shin Se-min has this report. Security breached. Five movies produced by Sony Pictures have been leaked online after the company's computer system was hacked in late November. It's estimated to have cost Sony Pictures tens of millions of dollars in financial damages. The Federal Bureau of Investigation has notified U.S. businesses to be aware of new destructive malware and cyber attacks. In a confidential flash, an FBI warning issued Monday provides details on the malicious software and called on businesses to protect their information systems and limit access to their databases. The report says the malicious software overwrites all data on computer hard drives. The FBI spokesman, however, declined to comment on whether this flash software was used in the cyber attack on Sony. Employees of Sony Pictures found themselves locked out of their computers last week. They turned them on to find the phrase, hacked by GOP, or the Guardians of Peace, which has claimed responsibility for the attack. Sony said the theft of content was considered a criminal matter and that they're working to address the issue. There's speculation that the attack could be linked to North Korea, as Sony Pictures produced the interview, an upcoming comedy film that centers around a CIA plot to assassinate North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. The North has so far refused to deny involvement in the attack. Since I'm in, Arirang News.